Hey guys, Photoshop Pro help here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create an easy fisheye effect. Now, there is two ways of actually doing this effect, and I'm going to be showing you both. Now, these ways are extremely easy and simple and very fast. So, this is the effect that we're after, and it's pretty nice and is very similar to the fisheye. So, if you don't have a really expensive filter to create this effect, then you can create this effect easily in Photoshop. So we're going to go and jump over to our original image, here it is here, and all we're going to do is we're going to try, and try the first way, so if you have a rectangle image we need to make it square, so we're going to go and go over to the crop tool, we're going to hold down shift on our keyboard, and we're just going to go and drag out making a perfect square. We can go and drag and put to wherever we want, so we're just going to go and crop it to wherever we want it to be and so about there would be okay click the tick icon we're going to go up to filter we're going to go over to distort spherize and you're going to go and play around with the amount and i'm going to go and keep with 100 but you can play around with this so you can go and click the minus icon and see what it looks like and that's pretty nice as it is so i'm going to click okay and we're going to go up to the circular so the elliptical marquee tool on the left hand side sorry and hold down shift on your keyboard and drag out and make in a circle around it so about there and all we're going to do is we're going to go and make put a masking on this so bottom right hand side click the little mask layer click that and as you can see we have our fisheye effect now that's pretty nice. Now the other way of doing this, which is a dead simple way, is we're just going to go back and keeping with our square image right here, we can go up to edit, go to free transform and if you can't get to free transform it's probably locked so double click your layer to unlock it and or you can press Control and D uh, T sorry to free transform and right click press warp and then go up to the custom drop down menu and go to uh, go to sorry let me find it fisheye there we go and we can play around uh, with this this center right here we can bring it up and down and we want to bring it up but this is not a proper fisheye um, sort of effect now it's pretty nice but it really depends on your taste at the time and what you're after so go and have a play around and try these two different effects now there is plenty of people on YouTube um, teaching you these two ways so I thought I'd give you this way as well so have fun please let me know if you do need any help and please comment rate and subscribe please go visit the website facebook and google plus guys loads of stuff for you to go and check out and i'll see you next time guys bye for now